a really bad boy. Tequilas, and we are true tea, tea. One, one cup, cup at, at a time. time. You're not gonna raise your cup? You ain't ready for the new year? Woo. I'm ready, I'm ready. I'm just now getting over the flu, but I I'm know. so ready. I'm oh sorry I missed that. By the way, circle, circle, dot, dot, now I got my cootie shot. I'm not facing you. Turn that Thanks so much for showing up, though. I tell you, you, you are, are the most faithful person that thank I know. You, thank I you. Really Please excuse my voice Besides today. Myself. It's not as delicate and feminine as you. <laughs> A little scratchy. <laughs> Wow, so what's going on this week? I mean, there's been so much happening. Oh, New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. Absolutely Tony Park, Bradley, Southern. Yeah. The Tree Tree side. What about area. Sunday Fun Day here at the Tequilas? Oh, yeah. Tomorrow, so, Joey Brooks do? is here. What did you do? Honey Pot. Honey Pot. And what did you do on uh, New Year's Eve? What, well, this year? Last yeah, year? Yeah, this oh. year. Well, I can't say that. Carrie's at the table here right now, but he was young and very cute. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Carrie, close your ears. <laughs> well, we're going to show you a clip of actually what I did in Sarasota because I covered a huge pineapple drop, over 100,000 people, and wow. I hosted it, and I can't say I wasn't nervous because that was a very scary thing to do. Yeah. Wow. I, uh, Congratulations. That thank you very much. Yeah, yeah it was pretty good. Pineapple. But listen, there's nothing like spending New Year's in Ybor City, because this really is home for me. Absolutely. I mean, it's it always a us. huge thing that happens here in the city. I love it. Well, as wild as in Ybor, it is wild. Crazy. The yeah. honey yeah. pot was unbelievable. Oh. The balloon, we had a balloon drop as well. You should have seen all those kids fighting over the balloons. Oh, my God. Also, <laughs> our uh, special guest, DJ Ranny, producer DJ Ranny, yeah. was in the house. I believe he's been at the honey pot for the last six or seven years. Weird, we absolutely yeah. love him. Yeah. Amazing night at the honey pot. And the break is awesome. Can can I spill some tea? Can I spill some tea? Absolutely. Well, there's a certain location at the Honey Pot. I'm not going to say where it is. Wink, wink. Anyway, they have a notorious New Year's Eve big dick contest. Well, this year, Carlos lost. <laughs> 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 Oh yes, he came in. He gave him second place. First place was a visitor visiting us from New York City. So you won? Oh. No, oh. I, I was a judge. Oh, you were a judge. Okay. Oh, I love the big dick contest. It's the best part of the whole weekend. <laughs> they keep that. And we have that on yeah. film. We'll show that right after That's the show. That's fine. Oh, good. I'll see it then. I missed that. Oh, the highlight. <laughs> Well, and Dick, what about you? What's been going on with you? Honey Pot is my thing for New Year's Eve. Yeah? It's my favorite place to go for that party. And I think we're going to roll that clip because we've got some yeah, footage from there. Do. And yeah. it was crazy, so oh, check it out. was amazing wow it looks like uh you had a big time and, there and you know there was money in all those balloons that were flying Ooh. down there that's why they were oh. fighting over them. money 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 it's all nice, about that money, money. Nice. 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 the money it's a good way to start the new year <laughs> that is very good money. so yeah, how long have you actually been working there well i've actually been working there probably nine years i've been the show director for six now since you were wow. 14? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wow. just told someone my age earlier and I thought they were going to fall down. <laughs> I think they did. <laughs> they did. They did. Maybe. And? 
Carrie. Yeah, no, it was fun. I, I enjoyed the parade. The parade's always fun. Um, and we, we start getting the marching bands uh, from the universities out there. We got Michigan and you got, I mean, Michigan, Iowa, and, <laughs> and also from Mississippi State. It was, it was awesome. Uh, all the high school bands in the area coming down and really the people, the, just the people having a great time on the streets getting their team a great yeah. big you rah rah you know yeah. and it was a another big year for ebor city i'll tell you that and that was wonderful and tampa have i have a tampa. question did anybody yes. notice they've already taken club bush down i think oh yes they have <laughs> <laughs> if you don't recall seeing last week's show club oh, bush is the it. big giant tree they have here in central ebor and somebody at this table let us know that there was a big space in the inside that we renamed club bush <laughs> it took it down before the parade i didn't understand that i didn't either it was for new year's i thought everybody's gonna say wow because it's spectacular absolutely and everything out there yeah. huge wow. but all the clubs are filled i meant the streets are filled and it was a wonderful it was a good great new year's absolutely so, great celebration for ebor my yeah. favorite holiday of the year oh Amy, what you got coming up? Well, speaking of favorite holidays, Gasparilla is coming up really soon. Yes, it is. We're so excited about that. But before we get to that, listen, folks, January 14th, at Pri uh, we're going to have Pride Skate at the United Skates Roller Rink. I believe that's on Armenia. Proceeds yeah. are going for the Tampa Pride, yeah. which is March they 30th. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Oh, they do. They do. Well, good. I believe they do um, on Tuesdays. And it's going to be the Pride Skate, 9 p.m. at United Skates. We have DJ Greg Anderson. I'm going to be performing as well as Conundrum. So come out and support us supporting Tampa Pride. Good. Wow. That's a good. I think we'll take this opportunity to go into commercial. We'll be right back after this message. And we'll see you right back. Cheers. When reliability, fuel economy, and just completely fun, choose Mini of Wesley Chapel. Call today to schedule your free test drive. 813-527-0825. Welcome back. Well, guess what? We've got to talk about the amazing buffet, the brunch buffet they have here at Tequila's. This time we actually got a little sample of it. Are you yep, gonna take yep. a little bite it, it of it? Is, it is good. The <laughs> sausage, scrambled eggs. Nine ninety five. Fries. Nine ninety five. I mean, wow. what oh. more do you want? And, and, and that's, that's not all. Of it. On, on Sundays we have the drag show here too. Drag with show. Joey Brooks as a as MC here. Joey Brooks. Yeah. Every Sunday at one thirty she goes on stage here. Wow. Absolutely. Sunday fun day in Ebor City can never get better. And oh. then we also have you here. And teacups here. Hello. Tea on the patio. Drinking Shazam! 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 So if you want to know on Saturday and Sunday where to go in the afternoon, late Come morning, here. afternoon, start your day if you want to know where everybody hangs out, this is the place. This is, this is the place right here in Central Ebor. Yeah. Yes. The best thing I think to do come here get your buffet on here and then you come see us live right yeah. yep. saturdays three we're here three o'clock so make it a point to be here for two yes yeah. absolutely you can sit out there and we'll wave at you yeah, yes we Maybe will. You can good send crowd us a note or ask good. us a question we hey, might answer you had some other announcements you were going to oh i do about. speaking yeah. of the gasparilla yeah the um, oh. gasparilla parade uh, bayshore boulevard january 26th it's going to be absolutely amazing one of our biggest events here in gasparilla and then two weeks later february 10th is our night parade they close off 7th avenue and there's going to be a great parade going down 7th avenue so make it a point to put it in your calendars oh come out and check out gasparilla Oh, wow, yeah. I mean, yeah. that's a huge thing. How many all years has that been? How, that, how many years has that been going on? You should know all these things. Well, You're I should, but I'm not sure. It's over a hundred. It's over a hundred years. Over a wow. hundred years, and, and they still move it, and it's getting bigger, and it's pirates, pirates, pirates. I'm wow. not really so. sure of the history of Gasparilla, but I know it's something about Jose Gaspar, who was a pirate, and it's when they came to the port of Tampa. And they pillaged and plundered all the gay folks. That's right. <laughs> the city. And I do know there's one or two butt pirates in that group too. Let me tell you. Yeah. Butt but pirates. Pirates. I love the butt right. pirates. Yeah. I'm check that T. <laughs> yeah. So Tyler. Yeah. Last week we went on a stroll through Ebor, and we talked to a few people. And I checked back this week. There was one person at Carne 
that you talked to. Yes. You remember what he wanted for Christmas? A big bucket of money, I think. He got it. He I got to it? Him. He said he got the money he needed and wanted. Oh, nice. was that the help yeah. of you, Dick? Nice. <laughs> no, my Very brother nice. asked did you? Did Dick help? <laughs> Very nice. Well, guess what? We went on the streets of Ebor and asked our friends here in Central Ebor a little bit about yeah what they were doing for New Year's and what it was all about for them and their New Year's resolution and all that. So let's roll that clip now and take a gander. Yeah. All right, we are in the streets of Ybor City and I ran into my new friend, Bob, AKA Jack. I gotta ask you, buddy, viewers wanna know, what's your New Year's resolution? Happy, healthy, and a lot of fun. That's what it's all about. All right, Amy, New Year's resolution. What is it right here in Ybor City? Health and happiness for everybody. Health and happiness. It seems like everybody's asking for that. No pot of gold or millions of dollars this year. No, not this year. All right. <laughs> I ran into Rebecca. She's here. You live in Tampa? No, Houston, Texas. Oh, you're visiting. Well, yes. welcome. I'm visiting Ebor too. Awesome. <laughs> not really. <laughs> All right. So we got to ask, our viewers want to know what your New Year's resolution is. Okay, I need to lose like 20 pounds. Where? I can't Where? tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Close hide a lot, right? Right. <laughs> Thanks yes. so much, Rebecca. No problem. Bye. Well, it looks like yes. everybody had a little bit to say on uh, Central Ebor, right? Yeah. Wow. Well, so I think we could uh, definitely say, Teacup, you've been experiencing a lot of joy here. You've got so many. It's like a little club for you I outside, love it. right? Are you kidding? I love it here. Are you kidding me? I love it. Hundreds and hundreds of people showing up here all the time. It's funny because all... I see all like the Hamburger Mary's old crowd from like your little area oh, that yes, you're at. They're all here. I always see them here at the patio. So all, every, every Saturday and Sunday they're out here. Saturday and Sunday. 11 to 7. Yeah. And they come in all the time. And this patio is so much fun and so cool out here. It is. I love it. Yeah. Love, love, love. And there's games to play out here and pool, live music. Live music. Who wouldn't love to be great. here? And the owners here and the staff are incredibly nice people. Yeah. So. so are you only here on Saturdays and Sundays? That's it. Two days a week only. Saturdays and Sunday. Because you're busy building that house during the week. I'm working right? on that plantation yet. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, that Does, slave driver over there. He's does, does he keep adding on the workload he does. Or, and say he one does. more thing before it's done? He does. He does. He keeps well, whining, more he keeps whining well. the dungeon isn't good enough for us. I'm like, oh, no. really? <laughs> the party room. The dungeon's fabulous. He should be, he the should party be palace. Well. The party palace. Uh, <laughs> the little sitting room there. Okay, we got to do the show from, from the front. Yeah, we'll we do it should from, definitely do we'll that. We'll do it from the Love Shack. Oh, How's that sound, okay. guys? That's a great yeah. idea. Right yeah. from the balcony. There also, we go. that's a good thing, too. People, this show can travel. So if there's any businesses or, or establishments out there that yeah. want to host our show, right. True Tea, make it a point to reach out to Tyler or Thanks, one of the people Amy. on the panel, yeah, we idea. might consider it. Absolutely. Yeah. And maybe you'll get up and do a little shimmy on the I <laughs> might. I can do a shimmy right now. <laughs> All right. Well, with that being said, I think we're going to bring it to an end. What do you think? All right. It's good. It's been another great, it's it's been a great, great week here. Yeah. A great week. Absolutely. Great week. Absolutely. It's just a good rocking. one. I hope you have great resolutions and stick to them. Absolutely. Don't you think so, Amy? I, I agree totally. So happy New Year's. Happy, happy New Year's, Year's, everybody. All right. That's going to bring the segment to an end. We're going to see you again next week when we're True Tea, tea. One, one Cup at a Time. time. This has been an Out and About Media Broadcast in association with Channel125.com.